uh, last night, uh, I watched again uh, a movie called Timeline. And I read the book by Crichton, Timeline, and was fascinated by the theory of it. And when the movie came out, I saw it on a for sale shelf. I don't think I ever saw it in, I know I never saw it in the theaters, but I didn't even know that it existed when I bought it. <coughs> Excuse me. But, but the premise is that these archaeologists, and here's, here's, the, here's the kind of funny thing, they don't go back in time, okay? They're in, living in 1998 or 2000 or something, but they don't, but they, and they go to the year 1300, 1357, I think it was. I, I'm not exactly sure. But they don't go back in time. It's not a time machine. Uh, in the movie and in the book, they compare it to like a fax where they defigure people and then put them in another space, in another, in another place. Right? And what they claim to have uh, found is a, is a wormhole that connects two parallel universes. And since I've read about parallel universes, I, I like the theory. Uh, I know it's just a theory, but I, as I've said in the past, I, I tend to look at things and, and I don't necessarily believe them, but I do enjoy looking at the possibilities. And I was reading in a newspaper in L.A. a few years ago about uh, parallel universes, how everything is going on at the same time, and there's parallels, and there are possibilities of moving between the universes, so you don't ever have to travel back in time, even though it would be history to us. Right? It's not. It's it's continuing. It's it's present time to somebody else. But it, I I just like the premise of the movie. I like the that it's it's not time travel. That it's a uh, uh, wormhole traveling or something. I don't know. But on that silly note, we uh, uh, time traveler. That was my my. I have an in innovation. Yeah, I don't know if y'all have tried it. If you travel, it's well worth it, uh, called the Jet Lag Eliminator. And the first, we brainstormed and brainstormed and brainstormed and thought, let's call it the Time Traveler, which says nothing to anybody. Um, it's a real neat little disc, shows which acupressure points to hit so that you can end up in the time that you're in when you get to uh, wherever you're going. And uh, so, but <laughs> we put it on this disc and call it the time traveler and it doesn't look. finally I looked at it and said no we're going to call this the jet lag eliminator because that is what it does it gets rid of jet lag uh, we've used it for the years but uh, I don't know whether you would need it if you were traveling back to 1357 or not or if it would even help or if <laughs> I, I was going to say I hope I never find out but uh, I don't know I, I may take the risk if I had a chance if I met somebody that could could say hey you want to go back to? Or you want to go forward to? I don't know. Interesting. www.micpeakperformance.com. Have a fun day.